Frequently, when discussing the marine life, people tend to focus on the large and intimidating creatures that inhabit the seas. However, it's worth noting that not all sea creatures are aggressive monsters. In fact, there are numerous friendly sea creatures that exist around the world. So, here are six examples of the most amicable marine animals. Number six, Caribbean Reef Octopus. The Caribbean Reef Octopus is a fascinating and intelligent invertebrate that is highly skilled at camouflage. These creatures can change their color in an instant to blend in perfectly with their surroundings, making them almost impossible to see. Despite this, they are surprisingly on the list of the friendliest sea creatures in the world. While it's a mystery how people get the opportunity to encounter them, it's impressive that they have any tolerance for humans at all. Habitat loss due to human activity is the main risk to their survival. These octopuses are mostly found in the shallow waters of the Caribbean, Florida, the Gulf of Mexico, and the Bahamas, and even in the western part of the Atlantic Ocean, as well as the Pacific. Despite their shy personalities, solitary lifestyles, and aggressively territorial behavior, these creatures are quite approachable if you're lucky enough to encounter them. However, given their hiding habitat, it's not advisable to attempt to hug one of these creatures anytime soon. If you do try to befriend them, they are likely to give you a warning and send you packing. In conclusion, the Caribbean Reef Octopus is a master of disguise, a fascinating creature with a shy personality that lives a solitary lifestyle. They are surprisingly on the list of the friendliest sea creatures in the world, and it's a wonder that they have any tolerance for humans at all, given the main risk to their survival is habitat loss due to human activity. If you ever come across one of these creatures, it's best to admire them from a safe distance and appreciate their beauty and intelligence. Number five, Amazon Pink River Dolphin. The largest and most clever of all freshwater dolphins, the Amazon Pink River Dolphin can change its color and even blush, a bit like humans do. These dolphins are actually born gray, like most other of their species, but then they slowly turn pink as they grow up. Kind of the opposite to humans who start off one color and often go gray as they get older. These creatures can grow up to 9 feet and weigh anywhere to 400 pounds, often living as long as 30 years. The males of the species are a stronger pink color than their female counterparts, and what exactly causes, this is still being figured out, but it's believed that it may have something to do with external factors like their diet and the way they interact. The fighting in which they participate causes scar tissue that may affect their overall coloration. And much like other dolphins, their intelligence makes them particularly appealing to humans looking for wildlife interactions with social creatures. But like other dolphins, their intelligence and ability to work together through communication with one another should give any other creature a second's pause, even us humans, if there were ever candidates for plotting world domination, it's these guys. Seriously, they may be smiling, but these animals have a lot more going on in their noggins than we give them credit for. Number four, otters. Sea otters are an iconic species that not only captivate our hearts with their adorable appearance, but also play a critical role in maintaining the health of the ecosystems in which they live. These remarkable creatures are one of the smallest marine mammals and belong to the weasel family. Worldwide, there are 13 recognized otter species, two of which are native to U.S. waters, the sea otter and the North American river otter. Sea otters are mainly found in the coastal areas of the North Pacific Ocean, with Alaska being home to approximately 90% of the world's sea otters. These endearing creatures were once hunted to near extinction for their fur, leading to significant population declines. However, thanks to conservation efforts, they are now protected by U.S. and international laws. Otters are carnivores, and their diet primarily consists of sea urchins, crabs, mussels, and clams. These intelligent creatures are also known for using tools to crack open their food. They need to consume 25% of their body weight in food every day to maintain their body heat in the frigid waters they inhabit. While otters are incredibly fascinating to watch, it is essential to maintain a safe distance, especially if they have young nearby. Like all wild animals, otters can be territorial and fiercely protective of their young. Therefore, it is best not to disturb them even if they are too cute to resist. 
In conclusion, sea otters are not only adorable, but also critical to the health of the marine ecosystems they inhabit. These intelligent creatures serve as an essential indicator of the health of the ocean, and their protection is essential to ensure the well-being of our planet. Number 3. Orcas The orca is somewhat unfairly also known as the killer whale. This super clever mammal is not a real threat to humans at all. In fact, there are actually no recorded attacks of orcas on humans in the wild. So it seems a pretty inaccurate name, but it makes these big creatures sound scary anyways. Although, if you're a sea-dwelling creature and this incredible sea monster is hungry, well, the orca is a member of the dolphin family, so they live in pods or social groups just like dolphins do. And they're really sociable creatures having a whole bunch of different ways to communicate with each other like dolphins. Orcas make different sounds that are used to interact with other orcas, and they use echolocation, which is where they make sounds that travel underwater and bounce off of objects. The orcas can then tell how far away, how big and what shape something is. Now that is super clever and an efficient way to find their prey. It is an amazingly strong predator with a wicked set of skills that makes them perfectly equipped to hunt and thrive in the oceans around the world. Orcas do enjoy a wide range of different prey. They are definitely killers in that sense. At the top of the food chain, they'll hunt anything from fish and squid to penguins, seals, and seabirds, and they're also pretty partial to the occasional whale. The orca sure does have a big appetite. Number two, divers off Portugal dwarfed by massive sunfish. The ocean sunfish is one of the oddest looking creatures in the sea. It is a large, tailless fish with huge fins that can often be seen floating on its side. But don't be fooled, this doesn't mean it's unwell. Actually, it's just sunbathing at the surface, which is why it's called a sunfish. Its enormous dorsal fin can be quite scary at first glance and is often mistaken for a shark. The ocean sunfish is the heaviest bony fish in the world and can weigh up to 5,000 pounds, which is as much as a small hippopotamus. To reach this size, they need to eat a lot, and their favorite food is jellyfish. However, since jellyfish are mainly made of water, these fish have to consume tons of them. Sadly, the ocean sunfish is in danger due to plastic pollution in the oceans. They'd often mistake plastic bags for jellyfish, which has become one of the biggest threats to their population. The ocean sunfish is considered vulnerable in the wild and needs our help to survive. Although they may not be as charismatic as sharks or whales, they still deserve a chance to thrive. Number one, scuba diver found a good friend under the sea. It may not seem like an obvious choice, but everyone has their own preferences when it comes to best friends. So let's not be too quick to judge. A scuba diver from Japan and an Asian sheep's head wrasse at first met in the waters of an underwater Shinto temple, located about 56 feet beneath the surface. Though it may be an unusual beginning for a friendship, we shouldn't dismiss it. After all, you never really know where or when you might meet your soulmate. If you're lucky enough to have a friendship like theirs, which has lasted for 30 years, then you're truly one of the fortunate few. It's worth noting that the two have grown old together. The diver, Arakawa, is now 79 years old, and the big fish known as Yoriko must be over 30 at the very least. While their friendship has always been platonic, Arakawa has confessed that he has kissed his friend. But who are we to judge? At the end of the day, it takes all sorts to make the world go round. That was an amazing journey through the world's oceans. I really enjoyed the friendliness that was shown throughout the trip. In my opinion, one can never have too much friendliness, even if it means kissing a shark or hugging a hammerhead. Have you ever come across an unusually friendly sea creature? Which one from our list is your favorite? Please share your experience in the comments below. Also, don't forget to check out the other exciting content on the screen. I look forward to seeing you again soon.